world <laughs> and welcome to the mech of mastery tv if it is your mission to become the greatest version of yourself in every area of life then you're in the right place in this episode we are speaking about friends family relationships personal development and the topic of this video is how to read people intentions how do we Let's get in the video. So, we all come to a point in life where, you know, we human. Everybody's gonna have that, that moment when people just literally do you over bad. You know, they hurt you, they break your heart, they cheat on you, they lie to you, they steal from you. You know, they be mean to you, they just do negative things, you know? And sometimes you get to a point where you're like, you get fearful about people about everybody you lose trust in general in everybody because one time when somebody break your heart the one time one time or a friend do something one it just take one time sometimes it's just like i didn't like that feeling I, I gotta have my guard up for the rest of my life that's how you feel and you you thought that this person or these people that were in your life and they was genuine you really thought that was your friend you really thought that this this guy that you were with was for you or this woman that you were with she was for you but it turns out that the intentions were bad and now you're having trouble trying to read people intentions i understand it gets like that let me tell you a story so first of all I was not the best person. I used to be a manipulator. I was a liar. I was a cheater. I stole. I did everything. I just did everything. 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 Something for a look. Okay, let me stop. Okay. I did a lot of things, a lot of hurtful things, but also a lot of hurtful things were done to me as well. So for example, um, I was in a relationship with a guy and I had a person that was a friend to me and I loved this girl. I mean, I used to love this girl. <sighs> like, I did things for her, her child. She was like my best friend. I used to wake up and I didn't just think about me. I thought about her too. Like, if I'm going to go eat, oh, if she ain't got no money, I'm trying to, you know, split it so we both can eat together. And I know she didn't have money. Go pick her up when I had a car. And this girl, she went behind my back and she had sex with my ex, with the guy I was with at the time. It broke my heart. Broke my heart for a while because I was, I genuinely loved her. Like, I was like, this my girl. Like, nobody couldn't say nothing even though she did bad things to other people, but in my eyes, she was not. So, here's, let's, 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 let's get deep. Y'all ready to dive deep? Okay, we gonna, we gonna dive deep. Here's the thing. First of all, you have to understand or state your intentions with things in life. So first of all, when you have people that come into your life, or you go into jobs or anything, you have to state your intention. Why? Why are you in this relationship? Why do you want this? Why are you in this business? Why are you buying this? What is the why? What is your intention? Once you know your intention, right? Stick, stick with me. When people come to you, right? You have to verbally, and you have to ask them, what's their intention once you see and they or their intention don't align with your intentions in that same whatever area of life that is that's when you start to make decisions hmm so for example i have friends right when i dated guys i had this guy i was dating it's another another situation i had this guy was um this guy i was dating i had this friend i flew this friend out you know, this guy has some money. He liked to pay girls to be around him. I was like in love with him. He was like, bring a friend for my for my fr for my friends. Bring the friend. He pay her for her time, whatever. But she didn't feel like she got paid enough for her time, as much as I was getting paid from the guy that was dishing out the money. Okay, I mean, let me... she felt that she should get more than me because she felt that she was better than me. So her intentions, right? My intentions was to bring a friend along the trip. It's a free trip, it's nice, let's enjoy time together, let's eat, let's have fun, girl, you get some money. That's what my intentions was. 
her intentions were something else. She needed more money to pay her bills. So guess what? She went behind my back and she went to try to sleep with that guy. That didn't happen, but she tried because that's what she needed. So the thing is now, when I choose people in life, I, see, I try to see how they're meeting their needs in areas of life, in all areas of life. Because, for example, if you have something that somebody else don't have in that area, sometimes, and they're, trying to not, they're not trying to meet it on their own in a positive way, they might just want to take it from you. You get where I'm coming from. Do you follow me? Yeah? Yeah? Okay. So here, let's, 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 let's rewind it. So here it goes. If you live in your life, you got a husband, you're in a, or you have a wife, you're in a relationship, you meet somebody, 